Hello everybody. Uh, in this video, I'm going to talk about the put coparenty relation. Put put core. Okay, sorry. Put core parity relation. So what is put coparity? So in financial mathematics, put coparity defines the uh, defines the relationship between the price of a European call option and the European put option in a frictionless market, both with the identical strike price and expiry. So uh, simply put, we can express the put coparity as the um, fiduciary fiduciary cost value equal to our protect, protective put. So what is it? Mm, so uh, which means uh, the value of a, of a put call option, uh, uh, sorry, uh, a European, Euro, uh, Euro call option plus uh, a bound with uh, face value equal to K. Okay, the bound face value equal to K, K dollar. Uh, equal to the European put option Uh, plus uh, one share of stock, one share of the underlying stock, one share of the stock. So now I'm going to prove this uh, equation. So this is a very important equation. Remember, uh, if this relationship uh, were violated, they, that means uh, there's the arbitrage opportunity. So how to prove it? So let assume there, there are two portfolios. There are two portfolios. Portfolio, portfolio X and portfolio Y, let's see. So portfolio X in portfolio X we have a we have a European call option. So uh, generally we use uh, small capital for European uh, call and put. So we use uh, small C here uh, means we have a European call options. And uh, in addition we have another bound. We have another bound which. Uh, have a face value of K, and uh, this is how to, how to, okay, for example, this is the bound. This is the bound. This is the bound. We have a bound. Okay, and in Y portfolio, in portfolio Y, we have a European put. Okay, so this is a small P, and we have one share of stock. So this is a share. Of stock, okay. As as means the stock. So let's draw a timeline from uh, time zero to time t. So this is time zero. This is time t. Okay. Let's exempt the the value of the portfolio x and portfolio y. Uh, and time zero and time t. Okay, and time zero. And time zero for for portfolio X. Okay, uh, for portfolio X, we have uh, we have the value is uh, okay. The the value is C plus Okay, the the bound the bound okay k times e minus r t. So this is 
so this is for the bond. This is for the the call option. So uh, of course it is the European call option. And uh, for for Y, we have uh, we have a protective put. Uh, we have the the, the put option. Uh, this is the put option plus the stock price uh, and time zero we call it S0 so so this is a scenario in time zero and uh, okay now time T in time T we have okay for for X for portfolio X in time T so uh, and time t, uh, the stock price uh, will will change to. So mm, here we have a stock, right? So the, the bound won't change. And put call. Okay, if the time the stock price uh, change to st, uh, if st greater than okay, it's um, so for x if st greater or equal to k, where k uh, is a strike price, strike price. So, okay, let's see, uh, here the zero time t, okay, st is uh, greater than t. So if st is greater than k, uh, which means the the car option is uh, have some value. The car option can be exercises to make profit. So for X, we have uh, we can exercise the the car option. So exercise car option. So exercise car option and and uh, time t, so we get we get uh, we get a profit of uh, s t okay minus k uh, from so get profit profit s t minus k from from the from the exercise of uh, of the car option from the car option so so in total in total we have uh, the, the 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 value of the x portfolio, portfolio x is uh, st minus k plus the bound the bound the bound value the bound the bound, uh, okay, the bound value is K, right? So, okay, so the value is ST. So, how about, uh, how about uh, Y? So, for Y, so for Y, if st uh, greater or equal greater than or equal to k k here is strike price so here p so the put option will be will be okay will be useless we have have low value and uh, we only have the stock there so the price of the portfolio the price of the portfolio, the price of portfolio Y is is K. Uh, so sorry, is uh, portfolio Y is ST minus zero. This is uh, this means the 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 put option price is zero. So in this situation, so we can get e, e, if uh, st greater than or equal to k, uh, 
the portfolio, the price of x, y are equal, right? So, so how about another uh, another scenario? How about uh, if s t less than k? Okay, if s t less than k, uh, for for x portfolio for portfolio x for portfolio x, if s t less than k. Okay, there's a call option. There's a call option. Call option will be so this uh this call option will be out of money. So say the call option value is zero, uh, but we still have a bond here. So we we the bond when the bond uh, matures, then we get uh we get money. We get k. Well, the value is k and time t and time t and for x for y for portfolio y okay for portfolio y if s t less than k so the put option is in the money so we can exercise put option so we can exercise the put option we can uh, put this stock puts the stock and uh, and uh, and and price uh, k. Actually, the the, the market price uh, here is st, but since k is greater than st, so we can sell it uh, with the price of k. Yeah. So we get a profit. Uh, we get a we get money of k dollars. So we so for portfolio Y we exercise uh, put option put option with uh, the share with a share so we get a key so we get key okay still and time t so in this situation we found the the value the value still equal the value of uh, portfolio x and y still the same so so no matter st no matter the relationship between st and k uh, st and k we can draw a conclusion safely uh, the portfolio of uh, the price of x and y are equal. So, so we can go back to to our uh, to our equation. Uh, we so we 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 prove the x and y are equal. That which means uh, the European call option plus the the bound value, the 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 k, uh, the bound value, uh, the plus a uh, plus a uh, bound with uh, with mm, with face value of of k, uh, and uh, the same uh, the same mm, the same time to maturity, the the same maturity, uh, is equal to the European put option. And uh, the one share of uh, plus one share of stock. So we have uh, here we have uh, C plus uh, K times E minus E2 minus RT. So this is the this is the current value. This is the current value and time zero of the of a bound. So equal P plus uh, s zero so this one is the put call put call parity equation